Kobe Sportswear, Canadian owned and manufacturer of high quality sports apparel and sold locally by Nova Trophy. Now located in Bears Lake and celebrating 40 years of service. Stop by today to get your team dressed in Kobe's best. Dartmouth Steel Subaru taking a 2-0 lead in the best of five in the Nova Scotia Major Midget Hockey League final. A thriller, 5-4 over the max. They win it in OT. Coach Steve Kroll, tell me about your team's performance here now that you have a 2-0 lead in this best of five series. Well, you know, it's, a, it's anything but over. I mean, that was, uh, that was a great showcase for Major Midget Hockey. Um, you know, it's just two teams battling out there. It was back and forth, and, uh, you know, I guess we got the last shot. Yeah, down, uh, trailing by one, and shorthanded a, a double minor to David Gagnon late in the third, and you get the equalizer. Well, uh, we threw Isaac Chapman out there. He, uh, he doesn't kill a whole lot of penalties, but we're down a goal, and uh, we were hoping we could get a bounce, maybe get an odd man rush, and uh, he did it. Tell me about uh, David Gagnon again with the overtime winner, his second goal of the game, but uh, tell me about his performance. Well, Dave's uh, just a pure goal scorer. That's the best way to describe him. I mean, when he gets in the scoring zone, it's on and off his stick, and uh, he can score with the best of them at this level. And uh, again, Ozzy King with a critical goal is also in the third period to get you back in. Well, they, when they went up 3-1, I mean, I, you just saw our bench you know, drag a droop a little bit, and he went right out that next shift, and uh, it just unbelievable play to set up Gagnon, and uh, that just got the momentum back on our side. Uh, tell me about the, the push in the third period. Again, uh, down, you got a huge goal, uh, but uh, tell me about that third period, the mentality. Yeah, coming out, like we knew we knew we had it in us going through a tough series with West. We, we knew we just had to push through. We showed some adversity, and we came in on top. Ozzy, take me through the that uh, the final minutes. You guys said a double minor. Gagnon picks up a double minor. You're down by one, yeah. and with four minutes to go, we knew we had it in us. So, I mean, it wasn't looking very good at that point. But Allison got the puck, fed Chapman back door, and he, he buried it. This guy's clutch. So you're up two nothing in this series, uh, and you're heading to home ice to Sportsplex. There, just tell me about the uh, the mentality and, and and how badly you want to end it on Tuesday. Definitely want to end it bad, but they're a good team. They're going to come out and they're going to give us everything they got. So we just got to go out and we got to play our game and see what happens. You didn't expect to be up 2-0 two, two after two games here in, in the Forum. Yeah, it, tough place to play, but we just we just gave it all we got. Like We, we want this, we want it bad, and yeah. Coach Kroll told me that uh, the bench was starting to sag until you get that goal, that big goal in the third, and how, yeah. how that really lifted, lifted the uh, spirits, perhaps, it gave you some momentum. Yeah, boys definitely got a little down on themselves there in the second when we went down 3-1, three, three but like, we knew we had it in us, and I, I just had to get them going there with that goal. Congratulations on the win. Thank you, John. Describe the, the mood in that room right now. You're up 2 nothing in the suit. Yeah, all the boys are pumped up. It was, it was a great win. Uh, they're a great team over there, but uh, yeah, it feels good. Tell me about the attitude going into this one, already having won a, won a game, one, and knowing that you're going to head home for three and four. Uh, but tell me about the, the, the importance of this one. Yeah, we knew we had to play a full 60 to beat these guys, and I think we did a good job of that. Third period didn't look good. There was a stretch there when things did not look good. And tell me about the, the mentality on the bench. Yeah, we were just trying to stay positive. Couldn't get down on ourselves. And uh, it was an intense one, but we got it. You had a couple of goals tonight. Uh, tell me a little bit about them. Uh, it was a couple of good passes for my line mates, and I just had to bury it. All right, two nothing. Heading over to the sportsplex, back on home ice for the the next two, if there are two more. Tell me about your approach. Well, you know, it's a, our whole model has just been taking one shift at a time. Uh, you know, it's a, that's a tough team over there. They were in first place for a reason, and uh, you know, we still got 60 minutes, so got got to win one more. Congratulations, coach. Thank you. Dartmouth Steel Subaru again with a 5-4 overtime win. They take a 2-0 lead in this best of five series. Tuesday, Sportsplex, game three. John Moore at the Forum in Halifax.